Graham Engineering Corporation continually researches and designs blow molding solutions for today's competitive marketplace. One recent addition to the lineup is a 12 station rotary blow molding system specifically manufactured to produce two sizes of oil containers. This single Parison machine utilizes a 6 inch 24 to 1 L over D grooved feed throat extruder. The grooved feed throat extruder provides higher output values and low melt temperatures than conventional smooth bore extruders. A 1.5 inch 24 to 1 L over D stripe extruder supplies the necessary material to create the view stripe requested by customers. The flow head on this system utilizes a Moog servo system wall thickness control which includes a 40-point Parison programmer. It also includes a remote adjustment feature for controlling the tooling concentricity. The Parison concentricity can be fine-tuned electronically at the operator station while the machine is running. The head is designed to minimize color change over time and provide uniform Parison formation. Both of the bottles produced on this system are based on the same design and have the same cross section with the difference in bottle height providing the change in volume. Working with the mold supplier, GEC specified inserted molds, allowing the two bottle sizes to be produced by simply changing a cavity section in each mold. The blow molding wheel provides consistent and repeatable bottles. Mold opening and closing is driven by a mechanical arrangement requiring no hydraulic or electronic valves or timers. Similarly, blow needle penetration, blow time, exhaust time, and needle retraction are completely mechanical, resulting in reliable and repeatable bottle production. Only water and air enter the center hub of the wheel through the rotary union. Like all Graham Engineering wheels, this 12 station features upward extrusion, allowing the Parisons to be captured and held at both ends. The bottles are discharged at the 6 o'clock position. The molds are opened using cam control, which suspends the container with flash directly above a transfer star wheel. The release timing is such that the log drops into a slot by gravity and is then placed on the takeaway conveyor. The conveyor includes vertical flights to separate the containers as they are driven to the next operation. The cooling conveyor includes a tail cooling plenum at the 90 degree turn to assist with extra cooling of the tail section on the containers. Prior to entering the trimmer infeed section, the containers are automatically inspected for position by a series of electronic sensors and removed by air if located incorrectly. The trimmer is comprised of four operations, infeed, deflash, reaming, and discharge. The infeed loads two containers per cycle utilizing a gate, which always ensures that two containers are available and that the trimmer transfer buckets are correctly positioned before opening. The D-flash station utilizes a vertical die set, which removes the excess material from the log. While the unit is in the closed position, cylinders operate two knives, one on each bottle, which separate the blow dome from the bottles with a rough cut. The reaming station is made up of two reaming units and two sets of neck jaws, one for each container. First, the jaws locate and clamp the bottle in position. Then the reamer approaches and faces the sealing surface. Both units then retract, allowing the index to proceed. The finished bottles are discharged onto another conveyor alongside the machine, this time sitting on the bottle base. The 12-station rotary blow molding system is controlled through an easy-to-use PC machine interface, the Graham XBM Navigator PC Control System. It features universal graphic displays in dual languages and utilizes a Beckhoff industrially hardened computer. Functions controlled include the 40-point programmer, extruder temperatures, screw speeds, and die head fine-tuning. The PC control also features remote diagnostics for off-site troubleshooting and services. GEC's 12-station rotary blow molding system produces containers up to 185 grams in weight at a rate of 30 bottles per minute. 
Combining innovative solutions and leading edge technology, Graham Engineering continues their commitment to be the industry leader in extrusion glow molding.